Good evening. EMTs at the Detroit Fire Department, they are among the first. They'll be able to get the vaccine this week if they so choose, but it will be their choice. It will not be required. That was something that was very clear at the press conference today. Detroit Mayor Mike Duggan was among several other leaders who did publicly get that vaccine to demonstrate they believe it is safe and effective and the best way to move forward. <laughs> COVID-19 has taken thousands of Detroit lives. Ten months of being ravaged. Illness, job loss, shutdowns, financial loss. Michiganders and Detroiters have taken a beating. And now... We are finally uh, fighting back. These little vials are the light at the end of a dark tunnel, potentially bringing about the end of homeschooling, the reopening of businesses, socializing with family members. Today, Detroit Mayor Mike Duggan and Chief Public Health Officer Denise Fair and Henry Ford Health System President Wright Lassiter were among the first to be vaccinated. Tomorrow, uh, the first city employees uh, will be getting their COVID vaccine. Uh, we will have 30 employees at the health department, the folks who will then go out and offer vaccinations to others. And uh, we're going to start tomorrow with the 1,200 medical first responders and EMTs that work for the Detroit Fire Department. And then the following week, the health department staff will be out with the home health workers so that the workers who are taking care of you in your homes will also be vaccinated. Which begs the question, just how many vaccine doses does the city have? Henry Ford Health System says they received 975 Pfizer vaccines per hospital. They received 1,200 Moderna doses on behalf of the city, and they're expecting another 13,000 doses of Moderna to arrive soon. But the numbers of doses being sent keeps changing. It's a, it's a bit of a logistics um, uh, Rubik's Cube for us. All of us going to vaccinate based on what shows up every day. When COVID tests and PPE were slow to arrive, Mayor Duggan went directly to the source, but he says obtaining vaccines is different. The federal government owns all the vaccine, and so literally they have to distribute to the state. Uh, the state then distributes to the hospitals, to the counties, uh, et cetera. And so in this case, I don't have the ability to take a van uh, up to Kalamazoo and haul it away, uh, or I would. Speaking of the fact that the federal government does own these vaccines and is controlling the rollout, that is part of the reason for concern. And coming up at six o'clock, uh, both the mayor and several leaders addressed the very recent history that plays into some people's concern and suspicion of the vaccine. They also address how this vaccine was conducted differently than some of the past medical things that have been rolled out and why they believe it is safe and effective. Reporting live in Detroit, I'm Jennifer Ann Wilson, 7 Action News.